Yo guys, today I'm gonna show you how to make a mashup in an easy way. So let's go. So the first thing that we need to to have to make a mashup is in at least two tracks. So I choice for my mashup uh, two tracks, one in just one version and one in radio edit and extended version because I the original version is a radio edit and I I chose these two versions to use just extended in this mashup and radio edit in the drum you will see so the first one is from Sonnery James and Ryan Marciano Yeko Yeke Yeke you probably um, know uh, which which track uh, this one is and the, the another track that I choice is can get over you from Kush <coughs> I'll put two versions uh, right there and yeah let's listen the first one and the first step to make your mashup is cut your tracks the tracks that you use for the time that you need the tracks uh, the track to play in in your project and yeah that's it so i'll put my headphones sorry <laughs> Exactly the time, the, the time that I I will use. Okay, so I can cut it right there, right here. Oh, sorry, and <coughs> we need to choose our B BPM. I'll choose uh, a hundred and twenty-six, and we need to put in the right uh, time of the, the, the tracks. So this one is 128. It's stretching. So this second track in both versions is 123. One twenty three. Okay, and this one too. <clears throat> this is the first step before the, um, the cut of the tracks. So okay. So we will start with this part, but we need to choose the last part um, before we, we we change to another music. So I'll I'll choose the um, the part after um, the build up to cut. <laughs> Here is the drop, so I need to cut, maybe. Okay, I need to cut maybe here. And need to give a, a channel. Here I'll give channel one, or easy way to give a name to the channels, okay. This one you need to, to delete this one if you have your definitions of FL Studio with limiter you need to delete
and here for channel 3. Okay. We already give channels to this track. Now we gonna listen this one. Okay, this is the part that I want to use in the track. So I need to cut right there. And in the end of the, the drop. Okay, here is the the end of <coughs> the drop and this is what I need for make my mashup this is my mashup you can make uh, your mashups with all styles uh, and like you want this is the tutorial for this mashup okay and in general I make my own mashups like this so I'll cut this part because it's normal the, the, the extended is it's the final part of the track so I'll listen if it's exactly here um, so <laughs> this is so cool to me and okay now we need to fix the, the time and the, the parts of the track that we will mixing and for it for mix the tracks in your mashups I use <coughs> parametric EQ and give a uh, exactly automation clip here because when I when I need I'll cut the low frequencies to start mixing another music so yeah and this one needs to maybe the last one don't need we will see <coughs> So, okay, this is so cool. Now we need to see. Let me put this one. Okay, maybe here. Let me check with start of the drops. Yeah, maybe here. Exactly. Right here, we will cut the low frequencies. to have the low frequencies and cut but not much because the sound we need to to have a strong sound of this trumpet to mark the transition and to enter in the drop of uh, the, the second track not much but maybe
Okay, we have the first part. And here we have the the part just some cut, some echoing and just it. Let's listen the final mashup. Let's go.